It's the bottom of the bag. Our tale of the tape for this strawweight fight. Here once more, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC strawweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Bad Intention. And now introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Keisha the Tiny Tornado Torres. You ready to fight? Ready. Well, her last win by knockout would be a tough act to follow as round one gets underway here. She really busted onto the radar of UFC fans by knocking out her last opponent. So now with momentum and the winning streak in tow, she will try to do it again. Got to get a win here, and certainly a finish would be useful as well. Oh, nice shot by the kickboxer there to stay upright. That takedown attempt would have put her on the floor earlier in her mixed martial arts career. She's working hard. Yeah, she's working very hard at getting better, but you can see the awareness now. Her understanding of how to move defensively whenever she gets hit with a takedown attempt. Beautiful to see her evolution inside the outcome. Straight right is there. She gets in very close and gets to the single collar tie. All right, so some adversity for her here. Looks like she has been opened up around that eye. Anything worth having will not be easy. But she's got to protect that cut because it will get worse if she continues to get hit on. Well, she ran a flush knee right there. to see making great use of her size advantage in this one. a front kick there. That's a great Muay Thai technique. When your opponent's trying to charge you, you land that kick to try to back him up and get your space exactly where you need it. Oh, roundhouse kick lands. Another head kick lands. Oh, brilliant execution to land the roundhouse. Back and forth we go. Shin to the dome. Shades of Valentina Shevchenko against Jessica Hyde. I'm not sure how many more head kicks her opponent can take. Maybe. She cannot take any more of these head kicks the way she is setting it up. Attempting a choke now. Ooh, that looks pretty tough. Oh, how good is that as she gets out? She is so aware on the ground and she escapes a deep submission attempt. What a kick. That one landed. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Nice jab there. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Big inside kick. Oh, leg kick. Stats in that department starting to pile up. Left hand connection and a right. Torres is cut, folks. Nasty cut on her lip just opened up. Torres going for the takedown here, nothing doing that. She got that leg kick off quick. Huge connection by her there. Lower the curtain. Bring the cast out. Bring the cast if you take the ball. The night's over. Well, we could be looking at an epic comeback here. She rocked her significantly, but wasn't able to finish the fight. Her opponent back in. Her opponent will not All right, she's going for the arm bar here. Ooh, she's got the arm isolated. She is moving to her finishing position. Oh, she's out. Wow, way to stay calm in a tough situation and defend that arm bar. Oh, and transitions right into side control. She's got to move out here. Print the shirts. Ground and pound. How good is her movement here on the ground, right? Shades of Ray Bohr just transitioning so beautifully. Yeah, she's so good at transitions and movement. Her ability is unmatched. Great job not only reversing the position, but getting to your dominant position. Beautiful transition. Oh, that's how you do it. Postures up and lands to the head. Oh, and there it is. 
So after an extended battle on the ground, she gets back to her feet, and the crowd is absolutely eating it up. She was not going to settle on her back. Even though it was very difficult, she finally works her way back up, and now she's got to let the hands go. 20 seconds left. Oh, she's got her back. Oh, nice headlock. Oh, she's got a rear naked choke, and it's tight. Posture's up now and lands a devastating strike to the head. Round two straight ahead. Heading back to the corner now. Torres' corner is going to have to take a look at that lip. It got cut in that round. It is starting to bleed profusely, and you got to think that could give her problems. Ready. Good. Second round here. Oh, how about that? Defense into offense. Blocks the strike, immediately counters with the jab. It pays to have length, and she certainly has the advantage in this matchup. Oh. Oh, pinpoint execution on that straight. She's got a reach advantage, and it was pretty obvious in that sequence there. Now she gains some separation. Well, you know she can do it all in the octagon tonight. She is largely a striker, and man, has she had it going really from the opening belt. From the start of the fight, you could see that she was different tonight. You could see that she was going to lean on the cardio, set a high pace, and hope that her opponent could not keep up. But not only is she fighting hard, she is landing just about everything that she throws. Effective punch from the clinch there by Torres. Great double change by these doors. Attempting a choke now. That guillotine is very tight. Oh, great submission defense. Well, through no lack of effort, she still hasn't been able to get the submission. You've got to credit the defense at some point. Absolutely. This young lady is so present defensively when she's under attack. She never panics. She's so calm under pressure. She seems to be a person that can't be submitted. Straight punch is true. Nice jab by her there, and another one for good measure. So before her opponent can reset, she doubles up on the jab. She does a fantastic job of popping that jab right behind her. But now, she's finding so much success that she's landing double jab. All right, so she continues to attack the body to great effect. Actually, some redness now underneath the elbow of her opponent. Yeah, she does a great job of attacking the body in multiple different ways. And it's starting to pay dividends for her. Again, nice job to post the hand and get upright. And we have passed the midpoint of the fight. Torres' his elbow attempt here. That one blocked by the defense. Oh, she's got to keep pressing now. Well, she was a little bit hesitant in round one, but she has certainly picked up the... Just out of range with the big right hand. All right, so a storyline developing. You see a cut has been opened around her eye. She's got a cut on her eye. She's been getting hit in that same spot. The cut's nothing too big right now. But if she doesn't protect it, it'll get a lot worse. Beautiful kick. All right, so just as we saw in the previous round, she is realizing a lot of success with her kickboxing game tonight, and you can see the confidence grow with every strike landing. It's overwhelming. Going for an arm bar now. Ooh, she's got it tight. Oh, she better tap her. That thing's going to snap. John, she's going to break her arm. She's going to break her arm. She's work. She's standing up. Work. Oh, she got it. Oh, my goodness. What a display of submission defense by the show lady. So dominant from the top position. Oh, another blow hits that cut. Referee might need to call on the doctor here soon. Beautiful elbow lands 
to the top position. Well, she is clearly dominating and winning this fight, largely with her striking. The book on her coming in was that she's a monster in the gym. Hadn't really put it all together in the octagon until tonight. All of her coaches talked about how special she was. And when it finally clicks, everyone's going to be impressed. Tonight, everything clicked. And you can see now that she has the ability to go real far. What a strike by her there. I Well, this is what you'll do it. Oh, my goodness. All right, so she gets the flush knockout here tonight. And you got to think this is going to lead to a lot of big fights the rest of the way this year. Big opportunities are presented after you have a performance like this. She did an amazing job and got a massive knockout victory. We go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer for the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 40 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout and intentions. Well, there she is. This arena belongs to her here tonight. Hard pressed to find a knockout in the women's game as stunning as that. I mean, she has so much confidence in her hand that she's willing to stand in front of her opponent and take one to give one. And when she gets... Mr. Bottom of the Bag.